Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve our skill rack daily challenge using Python programming language. First we will understand our question. The program must accept the integer n which represents the number of rectangles. Then we should get the length and breadth of the n rectangles. Then we should print the length, breadth, area of n rectangles sorted based on area. We have also given a note that if there are two or more rectangles with same area, sort them using their length. So consider this test case. So here we have five rectangles. So their length and breadth are given. Now let us find the area for each rectangle so 5 into 7 35 2 into 5 is 10 then 6 here also 6 here it is 24 now we have found the area for each rectangle so now we should sort them here we can see that these two rectangles have same area so we should sort them based on their length so first we will have this rectangle then we will have this and then we have area n so we will have this then we have 24 then at last we will have 35 Let us implement our program. First we will get the integer n that is the number of rectangles. Then we have assigned the empty list for the rectangle where we get the length, breadth and area for each rectangle. Then we have a for loop to get all our inputs. So after that we have got the length and breadth. So now we will assign the list of rect equal to length and comma breadth comma length into breadth so length represents the length of the rectangle breadth represents the breadth of the rectangle and length into breadth represents the area of the rectangle so after that we'll append the rectangle with rect so now we are done with our inputs now first we will sort them based on their length to satisfy our note that is when two rectangles have same area they should be sorted based on length. So first we will sort them based on length. So rectangle equal to sorted rectangle comma you use key key is equal to lambda where it accepts a parameter and returns it. So here rect. So we have length in the zeroth index. So we have rect of zero. Then after that we are going to sort them based on the area. So we have length into breadth in the second index so we have two here so at last we'll use the for loop for rect in rectangle we are going to print asterisk rect so now we'll run our test case so we have got this output which is correct so you can clearly see that the first two, two rectangles are sorted based on their length as their areas are similar then followed by other rectangles area hope you guys have understand thanks for watching see you next video